Yeah, guys, this is what's left of that gas pump that driver crashed into. Because of the damage here, it knocked all of the pumps at this gas station offline. A man's attempt at drifting at a Detroit gas station ends exactly as you would expect. Oh! This happened at the BP gas station on Joy Road in Southfield Sunday night. I seen him doing donuts. He was doing donuts, trying to, and he lost control, and then he hit, this, hit the pump. Amazingly, no one was hurt. Detroiters who have nearly seen it all stunned anew. Oh my goodness, that's crazy. Wow, they need to do something about this. That's so dangerous though, thank God nobody got hurt. As firefighters put out the flame Sunday, the driver sped off, hitting other vehicles on his way out. DPD recovered the SUV at this gas station at Warren and Southfield. We have that vehicle, we're doing some further investigation. Um, we are zeroing in on the person uh, who was driving that vehicle and we, we, we're gonna hold them accountable. The explosive escapade is yet another glaring example of the reckless driving issue in Detroit. DPD ramped up on efforts to crack down on drag racing and drifting, and the city is stepping up efforts to install speed humps to slow down speeding drivers that race through neighborhoods with little to no regard for stop signs or red lights. We've received over 20,000 requests from city or from residents across the city, and we will be installing 4,500 speed humps this summer. As DPD continues its investigation here, gas station employees say they're bleeding cash. Once this pump was destroyed, the rest became inoperable. We're losing business. Can't sell gas. Customers here in busy area, they come in and they're upset. They're leaving, cussing him out, upset at my son. What are you going to do? Detroit Police Commander Arnold Williams says cops can't be everywhere to prevent this kind of thing from happening, but Project Greenlight will help them find and arrest reckless drivers. That's what we really want everybody to understand. You may not see anybody around, but somebody's always watching you. Police say the SUV that barreled into this gas pump is registered to someone in Taylor, but the owner was not the one behind the wheel. Now, DPD is still cracking down on reckless drivers. This weekend, they made seven felony arrests, confiscated four weapons, and impounded 18 cars during a drag racing detail. On Detroit's west side, I'm Randy Wembley, and this is The Edge.